Trees and shrubs are an important component of our suburban environment. And I think we can all agree that having gardens and parks full of healthy, vibrant plants massively improves the quality of our living space. But the right plant needs to be selected for the right spot to avoid long-term and possibly costly issues. But plants need to be selected carefully to ensure that the right plant goes into the right spot and to avoid long-term and possibly costly issues. Not all plants, especially trees, are safe to plant in suburban gardens. Some have vigorous and adventurous root systems that will go hunting for any source of moisture available. And this can be bad news for articulation, drainage or sewer pipes. Modern plastic pipes are strong and completely sealed, but this doesn't mean they can't be damaged. A small hairline fracture is all the encouragement some trees need to send their roots into the pipes looking for moisture. And this can result in an expensive and messy repair job. Avoiding the drama and cost of having to repair whole sections of pipe work can easily be avoided by using a local resource such as the Water Corporation website to help with selecting the trees and shrubs for your garden. The website provides a great deal of information on the growth habit of many popular trees and the minimum planting distance from buildings and pipe work. It's easy to follow and will steer even the most inexperienced gardener in the right direction. Another important criteria to consider when choosing plants is water use. It pays to select water-wise plants. Hardy natives are the obvious choice. Once established, they will thrive on minimal water and most are low fertiliser users as well. Using less water and fertiliser is not only good for the environment, but it will also save the gardener money too. Remember to look out for the water-wise icon. Beautiful native water-wise plants not only look great, but they're also an important source of nectar and habitat for native flora. By carefully selecting and planting these types of trees and shrubs, you'll be doing your bit to ensure your suburb remains alive with native birds, insects and reptiles, which has to be a good thing. Selecting the right trees and shrubs for your garden may feel onerous to begin with, but by making use of available resources, it can be quite simple. The Water Corporation website has an extensive and informative plant selection tool, which is free and easy to use. While WaterWise accredited landscapers and garden centres employ knowledgeable, experienced and well-trained staff who are always happy to help. Planting the right trees and shrubs the first time will save you time and money.